Hello and welcome to my evening routine. I'm currently in the office. It is six o'clock. Oh, an email just came through and I am actually not done working for the day. Oh yes, someone just sent me something that I was waiting for. Perfect, so um, I still have some work to finish up this evening. So I'm working a little bit later than usual, but today's Wednesday and Wednesday is our sales reporting day. If you're new to my channel, I work in um, digital sales marketing for a bank in Toronto. Wednesday is our big sales reporting day and it's often the day that I work the latest. So welcome to my evening routine. <laughs> I can hear in the background that my mom just got home. So I'm gonna go take a break from working for just a little bit. I don't wanna lose momentum um, because then once I log off for the night, I am done for the night. So I um, will go say hi to her and she actually said she has a surprise for me. So we'll see what that is. But then I need to get back to this desk and just finish off my work so I can enjoy the rest of my evening. So come along. Hello. I see what the surprise is. <laughs> she's not even here, she's in the garage. Merlo, are you happy your mom is home? Hello. Hello. <laughs> I see my surprise. All right, <laughs> just ambushed you at the door. I'm filming an evening routine. So. <laughs> I found them, so I got two. Oh, thank you. Okay, if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I love this cup. Oh, that's cute too. She went to the dollar store. One for Remy, one for Merlot. Oh, cute. Okay, so the backstory of these cups. These are my favorite cups. They're actually from the dollar, the dollar store, Dollarama. Three dollars. And I have one here and I have one at my condo. And the one here, I dropped it a couple weeks ago and it broke and I was actually upset because I love these cups. They make me drink so much water during the day and they're just my favorite. And no other cup compares, I swear. I love this because of the, I'm telling everyone how excited I am. <laughs> I love how the, um, the lid screws on. I haven't been able to find them because it's obviously out of season. Like we're in the middle of winter right now and these are more of like a summer item. But my mom goes to the dollar store pretty often. There's one close to her work. So I told her, please keep an eye out for my favorite cup because I've been missing it. And she found them today, thank you. And she got me not only one, but two for backup in case uh, something ever happens to it again. You were so upset. I was upset. We need backup. <laughs> and they see the surprise. <laughs> and turtles, and my mail, I see it. Okay, I can't really show you, it has my address all over it. But I ordered from a small business, TikTok made me buy it. I also didn't tell you guys, my mom is obsessed with Facebook Marketplace. I swear, HomeSense closed during lockdown and Facebook Marketplace is the next big thing. It's always been a big thing, but my mother has recently discovered Facebook Marketplace using my Facebook account. How exciting. So I ordered from Cove Essentials and they make the best hair clips so I've seen. Mm, this feels really strong. Um, they have their claw clips and that's what they're known for. My hair is obviously in a ponytail right now, but the idea is that you can clip your hair up and it holds really thick, long hair. And these apparently are the best hair clips on the market. And then I got another silk hair scrunchie because I love these and I got one that's brown and matches my hair. And support local. They are from like Burlington, Ontario, I believe. <laughs> and I needed to support. You wanna do a demo? Your hair is long and down. The idea is that you can take your hair. <laughs> Does it feel secure? Mm -hmm. Yeah, very secure. All right, that's my whole. I guess a part of my evening routine is that I'm excited to open up any packages that I got that day. So I will leave a link to Cove down below because so far so good, I recommend. Oh my gosh, it is 8.14. I don't know why I had to work so late today. There was a bunch of things that came up at the end of the day, reporting issues, I had to explain things, and I just finally got around to submitting my final reports. I just closed the document, 
double checked that it saved correctly because I've had that issue in the past, but I was just in the zone for a little bit and I didn't eat dinner yet. I'm starving. I normally eat at like five o'clock, but I did have a later lunch today. So that explains why I'm having a later dinner, but I am really hungry, but I was kind of using it as my reward. I just wanted to like power through the rest of my work so that I can like truly sit down, relax, have dinner um, and enjoy it. But I even have something super yummy for dinner and I don't know how I've waited so patiently to eat it because I was just trying to get all my work done. So yeah, it is now 8.15. I'm going to log off and go have dinner. While I'm eating, my mom is entertaining me because she's negotiating with the dog to go outside because it's cold and he doesn't want to go. <laughs> but go he, potty, Merlo, potty. He's so stubborn. He is such a personality. That was fast. At least it was a quick one. <laughs> so much. Good boy, Merlo. Good boy. Hey, Merlo. Did you go outside? After having dinner and scrolling on my phone for way too long, <laughs> I just needed some time to like relax and unwind, turn off my brain a little bit. I now came upstairs and it's about 9.30. I'm gonna take a shower, which I normally take showers at night. And today I need to wash my hair because my hair is not looking so cute. It was a ponytail kind of day. But normally I would shower like right before I go to bed, but I'm gonna shower a little bit earlier because I wanna do my nails and I need my nails to dry, so it wouldn't really work out if I did my nails and then took a shower. And I'm gonna have a relaxing shower. I like to do this every once in a while. I will shower with all of the lights off except the, <laughs> the light in the shower. And I will light a candle, which is my favorite rose scented candle. And I will listen to like spa ambient music. And it's just so relaxing. Definitely recommend. <laughs> that is exactly what I need to unwind from such a hectic work day. <laughs> that was such a good shower. And now my aftercare routine. Right now I've been focusing on moisture and hydrating products because it is so cold and dry. We're in the middle of winter. So I live by my Aveeno cream here. It's the Skin Relief Moisturizing Cream. It comes in a big tub. It's fragrance free and it's very thick. I actually put this on my face and all over my body. Even though it is quite thick, my skin just like sucks it up because it's so dry, exfoliated in the shower. So hopefully my pimple is no longer going to be there in the morning. <laughs> put this on my face and I'm gonna put it on the rest of my body. And then I just started using this again. I only really use this when I have a flare up, but it's the Polysporin Eczema Essentials Flare Up Relief Cream. And I put it on like where my arm bends on both sides. That's where I get flare ups for eczema. And it's really been acting up lately because it's been like so cold outside. Otherwise my Bedtime routine is pretty low maintenance. Um, I'm going to brush through my hair very gently. It's really tangly because I don't know if I even brushed it today when I put it up in a ponytail, so it's been very tangly and I just start from the bottom up. I also find that since I colored my hair, I added some blonde highlight, balayage, whatever you wanna call it, um, in the fall. Ever since I colored my hair, it's been a lot more tangly and I've been a lot more conscious of damaging it, so I try to brush it out very gently, although it doesn't look like I'm being too gentle. I really like my brush. I have it at my condo, and I was thinking about getting another one for here or just bringing it, um, but I hate bringing things back and forth. I have the Tangle Teaser brush, and I really miss it. It's one of those things, you don't know you like it, until you don't have it anymore. But I found that it was so gentle on my hair and this brush is not as gentle. And that's about it. I don't put any hair product in my hair. I'm pretty low maintenance in that regard. 
and now it can air dry a little bit before I go to bed because then if I go to bed with wet hair, I don't find it uncomfortable, but I find my hair like the roots dry with all these weird kinks in it. So it's better if I let it air dry before I go to sleep. Now it's 11 p.m. and time to get into bed. The very last thing I'll do before I go to sleep is look over my work calendar for the next day. This puts me at ease because I know I'm prepared for the next day ahead and I can sleep easy knowing that tomorrow's a new day. And that's my evening routine. If you liked this video, please subscribe to my channel for more and I hope you have a great night. Bye!